Railo, I, I met my friend Watengula and I tell him, you know, why don't you take over the opposition? Why don't you just show us how powerful you... Why don't you call for demonstration, for example? Why don't you try to shut down central, the CBD, mm. so that people give you some credence, some people give you some credit, you know? What did he say? What, what can he organize, you know? You know? I mean, he can't call 100 people into CBD. I'm sure if he's watching, he will pick a quarrel with me tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> but isn't that the reality? <laughs> that, now, apart, that apart from Raila, yes. nobody else can call a demonstration or a crowd. I mean, give Raila his credit, you know. He's a man with some gravitas. Yeah. There's no opposition leader. Look at, look at the space gap in, in Kenya. And that's why probably, you know, Professor Macau is seeing an opportunity he can mm. fill it. Because nobody, I mean, Raila has joined the government and everybody is trying to beg or plead with Raela to take with him the government. <laughs> Including Kalonzo now, who's inside the tent. Eh? But he's, he's not inside the tent, he's peeping. <laughs> <laughs> what about...